Have you ever considered how working through your breaks can affect your health in very bad ways? Let's look at a sample scenario. Have you ever worked at your desk or your workstation for the entire day? You meant to get up for breaks, but you kept working. You weren't that hungry, so you just snacked at your desk because you were on a roll. You had intended to refill your water bottle throughout the day, but you didn't get around to it. In fact, the only time you remember leaving your desk is when you had to skedaddle quickly over to the bathroom and then you ran back to your desk so you could knock out one more thing from that never ending to-do list. Now, on the one hand, it's great that you can stay that focused and driven for the entire day. On the on the other hand, doing it this way, just staying at your desk the entire day and not really getting any movement is actually detrimental to your health. Various specialists I've spoken with have shared the following opinions with me about sitting all day long. Let's start with your joints. If you sit all day long, your joints stiffen and so do your muscles. And this decreases your flexibility, which leads to issues as you age. I know we hate to think about aging, but this is a fact. Your brain, many functions in the brain, most especially creativity and problem solving ability are revitalized when you walk for as few as five minutes. Your heart, nearly every function in your body from your cognitive abilities and your ability to focus to your immune system to your leg movement requires your body to maintain good circulation throughout the day. This means standing up and walking around for at least a few minutes each and every hour of your day. Your lungs, we lose oxygen capacity in our lungs if they're not exercised. And if you sit all day long and you never experience some kind of at least moderate increase in your cardio, then you're not exercising your lungs. Lastly, let's talk about your emotions. When you talk to mental health experts, they'll tell you that when we remain in the same physical space, that can make it more difficult to change our emotional state. And if our emotional state is one of higher stress levels, that means we are staying in the same elevated stress levels throughout the day, and that is not good. Now, if you go to the opposite extreme of sitting, you should know that standing all day long can lead to nearly the same issues you'd experience as if you sit all day long. The whole key is to move as often as possible throughout the day. And if you can't move very often, then at the very least a few minutes each hour throughout the day. If you experience the side effects of either sitting all day long or standing all day long, then your productivity levels are going to degrade over time because your brain functions will slow from either medical causes or just these subconscious worries that you have from all these various side effects you're suffering from. Additionally, you'll lose time to medical appointments to address all of these different issues. So please make sure that you take movement breaks throughout your day.